BNL Baseball is looking for a strong season in 2015. Well, we're excited about the, the new year, and uh, it's, uh, it's been a good first week of practice, and uh, we are going to miss uh, some of the seniors. We lost four seniors from last year, three that had uh, a great amount of time, and then also Jameson, who was academic All-State, was a good, uh, a good senior for us. So we're going to have to replace some of those guys, but we do have uh, some young guys. Uh, we have three freshmen to start last year to be back, and we got uh, some others with some seniors with Jack Green and Patrick Price and uh, Jake Alvey that also started last year. So we got some, a good blend of some experience and some youth and uh, some good competition for some spots. Early to tell yet, maybe, but what, what about strengths of this team, that you, at least on paper? I think our pitching depth is going to be our strength. Uh, we're going to be able to run eight to ten guys out in the varsity game and feel good about it. Uh, so I think that's definitely going to be one. We're going to really hit hard on uh, being more aggressive on the bases. we got some team speed, but uh, you don't have to be the fastest guy to run the bases and, and do it in the correct way. And uh, So those are a couple things. And defense, I think, will be I think will be real strong defensively. BNL is counting on experience, especially from the sophomore class, to improve on last year's 14 and 15 record. How important was it for those guys that played last year as freshmen and sophomores to learn and now bring that experience? Oh, no doubt. Uh, you know, that's, that's tough for a freshman to be thrust into that, or young kids, period, to be thrust into a varsity starting role. And, uh, you know, they're going to have a lot of experience and then also be able to share that experience with, uh, with the other kids as they come up. Yeah, we hope to be pretty good this year. Uh, last year we were good and we got some new talent coming in this year, so hopefully we'll be better than last year. Yeah, I feel like, I mean, the expectation level, we didn't, I mean, we didn't go out and win state championships, so really we're the underdogs coming in. And a lot of people, they realize we have good talent. We're going we're gonna to show them. You face some challenges. Number one, Floyd Central, number eight, Jeffersonville, New Albany, East. Yeah. A loaded conference and a loaded sectional, so how do you approach that? Well, we're just going to approach it like any other game. Just go into it, just our heads held high. We're just going to play it just like any other game. Yeah. We played with them last year. We beat Floyd and we beat New Albany, who was number three. Yeah. You know, so we just got we to go in with all the confidence we can. And yeah. We can play with anybody if we're on. So.